Hi Obi, it's David at Discount Forklift. I am standing here with your beautiful 5,000 pound Lift Hero Forklift, lithium ion powered. Her name is Caroline. She's got a name tag on both sides. She really likes it when you call her by name. She'll perform a little better that way. I'm excited to show you about this forklift. Before we do that though, I do want to show you a few things that uh, I'm going to send you. I'm going to send you this little goodie bag here, this nice little tote bag. And in that bag, first off, there's an equipment maintenance guide. This has got tons of good information in here about forklifts in general. Um, a lot of it may not be uh, specific to your lift because your lift is electric and has so little maintenance that needs is needed on it. But there is a checklist here um, behind the tab. If you go back to the tab, there's these uh, periodic checklists. There's a daily, I think there's a weekly and a uh, whatever time frame on there, behind there. I always recommend that people leave the originals in the book and shoot the photocopies out of there so you always know where there's a clean original. I'm also sending you this uh, discount forklift troubleshooting guide. This is one that uh, uh, questions have been asked over the, the years. People uh, ask common questions. This will hopefully answer some of the, the easy questions, the most obvious questions for you. So if you'd uh, take a few minutes and look through that. Like I said, I'm gonna put that in this tote bag here. I am also sending you this uh, nice shirt here. This is the evolution of lifting, the front and the back. There is also a hat in here. Lift Hero hat with the logo on it to match your, your forklift. Let me put this up here. I'm going to show you some things about this forklift. Um, if, I'm, if I'm pointing out some obvious things to you, I apologize, but I'd rather you have a reference where you can go back to it. First off, you know, here's your charging port right here on the right hand side. You don't have to open the, uh, the interior to do this. There's a little tab on there that'll flip this cap open. You can just plug your charger right in there. Uh, before you charge it though, please pull the key out of the ignition. If you'll pull the key out of the ignition and put it on the seat or something before you, you charge it, that way you can avoid damage to the, uh, to the battery when you're charging it. Always just pull that out ahead uh, before charging it and uh, put it right there on the seat somewhere close in the cup holder, whatever. You got a couple cup holders right there. A couple nice things. You've got a little paper clip right here. Um, if you've got an order sheet or something. Um, this button right here, this red button is very important. You don't need to use that very often, but that is your power cutoff. And if somebody pushes that, if somebody leans against it and you don't know it, or one of the other guys pushes it or something, that button's got to be up for you to operate the forklift. That will solve a lot of your problems right there if you just do that. Um, you can tell you've got good beefy tires on this. Take a look at the tread on those tires. They're great. It's just been through service. You can tell right here we've got a, a sticker on both sides of that. If you will uh, look at uh, the forks here, they've been safety painted. The red forks with the yellow tips is great. If you're outside maybe at dusk or at a dark part of one of the warehouses, something like that, it's nice to know where the forks are. We want everybody to go home safe and sound at the end of every day. So please pay attention to that. Um, come around here on the forklift, there's a clip right here um, where you can open this. Just open that clip and this will lift up. You won't have to do that very often, but uh, when you do, that's how you get into it. And there is a uh, little red thing right here where you push that and this will go down. You may have to uh, move the seat forward in order to uh, tip that up all the way. There's a, uh, right here, you can see that there's a uh, way to move the, the uh, steering wheel up and down. Put that where you want for your um, convenience and comfort. Um, stay on the subject of safety for a minute. Obviously, you've got your rollover guard there. You've also got a seat belt. Please, please, please wear your seat belt at all time when you're on the forklift. There is an interlock uh, on the forklift where you've got to have the uh, seat belt fastened. It's one of three things you've got to do before you start the forklift. Fasten your seat belt, make sure that the parking brake is on and that your transmission is in neutral. So you've got a transmission sl uh, switch here on the left-hand side. Um, if you will move it up, that's in forward, middle is neutral, down is reverse. There is a, a um, alarm on the back that when it's in reverse, you'll hear that, but um, You've got your lights on the right-hand side here and blinker as well. 
let me show you this. A um, little getting used to on this, when you turn on the electric forklift, there is no you know, grinding sound with the engine that you're used to. But if you look down here at your uh, dash, there's a, um, a display there. And if, as you go through that, it'll do a little self-check. It only takes a few seconds to do that. But once that goes to this screen right here, you're good to go. Your three levers here, typical forklift. You've got your up, down, you've got your tilt, and you've got your side shift. I'm going to demo all those for you. Um, everything else is just, you know, pretty typical forklift here. You know, you've got your lights on the front here. You can adjust those lights how you want. You've got it started here. Let's go ahead and lights are good. Tail lights, all that kind of stuff. Let me go ahead and put it into gear here. Lift the forks a little, show you what she can do. This forklift is great in so many ways. Um, the only noise you're hearing here is the tires squeaking on my painted floor here. This space is actually too small to, to truthfully show you how powerful this forklift is, but it's got a lot of pep to it. I think you'll like that. There's one of the other things I want to show you, the brakes. When you take your foot off of the accelerator, it really stops immediately. You can hear the backup alarm here. It's just as peppy in reverse as it is in uh, forward. And you can tell that when I take my foot off the brake, I come to a stop. One other thing that I should show you here, when you're backing up, there's a grab bar back here with a horn button on it. Horn in the middle of the steering wheel as well. So again, you know, it's a, it's a safety deal. We want everybody to, to go home safe and sound at the end of every day. Come back and work another day. Let's run this up. And all the way back down. Here's your tilt forward, tilt it all the way back. Here's your side shift. Guys, this is a great forklift. I think you're gonna love it. Hopefully it uh, saves you a lot of backbreaking labor, makes you a bunch of money. We appreciate you uh, supporting our business so we can support businesses like yours. And here's your serial number. Thanks, Obie.